uh, I have uploaded uh, uh, videos on AM modulator uh, using diode and uh, transistor based. Uh, those are the very, very low level amplifiers. Uh, they I mean the low level modulator circuits usually generates the power in milliwatts. This low level signal is further amplified by like one or two stages of the power amplifier. Usually these power amplifiers are made up of a, it may be class A or class A, B or class C. So this is as usual low level modulator, uh, carrier and microphone audio amplifier. Here it is modulated. This signal is usually in terms of millivolts. This millivolt directly we can't transmit through your antenna. Hence, we need a, some amplifiers here. That is a feedback amplifier. Means power amplifier, some two to three stages of the power amplifier. This is the final one. That is a final RF power amplifier. And most of the practical cases, these power amplifier, that is the RF power amplifier are in class C amplifiers. Yeah. Now we will see uh, what is the class A, class B and class C. This X axis is the conduction angle and Y axis is the efficiency here. And coming to the class A, uh, it means it gives the entire signal. It means whatever the input you are giving, it gives the output, but the efficiency is only 50% and it conducts for an entire cycle that is a 360 degree. Class AB, positive cycle and part of the negative cycle it allows. Again, it is a 50% of the efficiency. It means the output power amplifier is very small, but uh, compare all these things, class C has the highest efficiency and it conducts only a positive half cycle and this this will be the direction is 180 degree and this is about the class C amplifier means class A, class A B, class B and class A especially I am going to discuss on this class A because that is the class A amplifier used in RF power amplifier yeah high level AM yeah so we will see the high level AM uh, this is a circuit and all these diagrams and are taken from the textbook uh, frangel and this is a look at the circuitry how this uh, uh, high level am high level amplitude modulator works how these amplitude modulators are work uh, we will first analyze this circuit okay how this circuit here we have a one transistor here and the emitter is directly grounded here and the collector it is connected through a tuned circuit and there is a transformer. We will call it as a T1, this transmitter, transformer. Secondary of this transformer is connected to the VCC here. And what about the primary? Primary is the message signal. Means the, whatever the signal it is captured by the microphone, it is amplified and given to the primary of the transformer. Means there are two transformer here and T1 and T2. This is the primary and secondary, primary and secondary. While coming to the secondary of the transformer, this is directly connected to the antenna and primary it is a made up of a tuned circuit here. And carrier, carrier is given to this transistor, carrier signal. This carrier signal is given to this transistor. And message signal, this is the message signal that is appears at the primary of the transformer. And whenever there is a signal, varying signal means like it varies, same signal will be appeared across the secondary of the transform. If message signal is zero, then output is also zero. And coming to uh, this is about the message signal. When message signal is zero, output is zero, means simply transistor will work. But when message signal appears, whenever message signal appears, then okay, the discussion, okay, we'll see the discussion. Before that, this portion, okay, we'll analyze this portion here, okay. So, this is the biased here, okay. This, this will be again, this transistor is a final class C amplifier. This is the class C amplifier. Means only positive of the cycle, it will conduct. It will conduct only positive half of the cycle. Means whenever there is a carrier signal, whenever there is a carrier signal, if this signal is zero, if this signal is zero, then it will be conducts and again we be this portion it is a forward bias means during the positive half cycle only it will conduct whenever negative half cycle comes negative it will be reverse biased and there is no output 
and the same thing will be coupled to the secondary of the transformer when that will be transmitted. It means when message signal is zero, when carrier is applied, means it will be get rectified, means it acts as rectified and amplified okay, because collector small change in the IB will create a large change in the collector current means high amplification takes place means that half cycle of that will be get coupled here. Next token, whenever the message signal appears with this carrier, so this signal will be added or subtracted with the VCC plus VCC. Whenever positive comes, okay, it may be get added with the plus VCC. Whenever negative comes, get subtracted with the this plus VCC. Means that variation will appear here. Means that variation will be appears here. Means whenever the this message signal is appears, means high or low. So that that will cause us the variation. So in that way, the transistor will be start conducting means carrier, uh, whatever the carrier we given, so that will be get varied that because this change in the collector current will varies the output here, that is your carrier signal. That carrier signal is varied in accordance with this message signal. So that large variation means very, very high power. Current is usually very, very high, means high power will be appeared and when come to the again negative so because there's a class c it will conducts only positive half cycle what about the negative cycle how it is repelled because in that way it will be stored okay the energy is stored during the negative cycle of the signal negative cycle of the signal it will be start it is this these waveforms are similar to the diode and transistor amplifier so this these are but this this is the output this is the output here, but this tuned circuit again we have a capacitor here, so this will be discharging a polarity is reverse of this. So in this way, this high level collector modulator works.